Hey everyone, in today's video, I am going to be sharing my Sephora VIB sale haul. I am so excited to finally get to this time of year. It's one of my favorite things to happen every time. It's one of my favorite things to happen every time. But yes, I love the Sephora VIB sale. I look forward to it and I wait for it every single year. So without further ado, let's get started. There was also a friends and family sale a few weeks ago. So I did pick up some things during that time too. So I'm going to combine it all together, all in one. Let's get into it. I had to get this this year. It is the Too Faced Everything Nice palette. Last year I had the A Few of My Favorite Things set and I just couldn't get enough of it. I still use it. So I knew that I had to get this one. I was hesitant at first because I had the one from last year. So why get another one again? But my friend Yvette here on YouTube from Girl Can Paint assured me that the colors were different enough. And that was all I needed to hear to get the new one. So um, I'm really all about the shadows. You do get blushes, a bronzer, a highlighter, and some brushes as well. But I'm just all about the shadows. That's what I enjoy about it the most. And you get your different finishes. You get your mattes, your metallic colors, and your pops of color. It's just a gorgeous set. So I love this one. And I'm so excited. So I picked that up. And of course my hair is not cooperating tonight. And um, with the set you also get a makeup bag. And this year it's a pink glitter bag. And you also get a mini of their Better Than Sex mascara. So, love it, as usual. I also picked up this Bobbi Brown product. It's one of my first face products by Bobbi Brown. And it is their Highlight Powder in Bronze Glow. I love plastic cheeks. You guys already know that that's my thing. So, I, of course, when I heard so many good things about this, I had to get it. And this is what it looks like. It's a glorious bronze highlighter. And I just can't wait to just put it all over my face. Anyway, that probably sounded really bad because it's 3 a.m. But anyway, I can't wait to have plastic cheeks with that product. There. I hope that sounds better. So sticking with the highlights, I also picked up another Becca product. This is their Shimmering Skin Perfector Pressed in Rose Gold. And here it is. It's beautiful. I do have, I swatched it and it reminds me a lot of Orgasm Blush by NARS. So that's, it's a similar color, but this is a highlighter. It's just going to look super glowy on and beautiful layered on top of other blushes so I am just obsessed I love these things love them I have the one in opal which met um, a tragic death <laughs> but here it is I'll show you what happened to it it crumbled because these are so finely milled they're so delicate you have to be very careful but it's such an amazing product that I still went and got another one even though I know what the risks are so I also picked up this Bobbi Brown, oh, Bobbi Brown again, This their bronzer in the shade Natural. My favorite bronzer at the moment is the Kardashian bronzer, but I find that it doesn't show up as much as I would like it to in photographs, but for every day it's perfect. But just for like camera work, I wanted something a little bit stronger. So I had heard so many good things about this that I picked it up. And this one pulls towards those warm tones like the Kardashian one so that's when I knew that I'd probably like this one as well so I picked that up next I picked up again these bite lush lip wipes these things are like magic they are so amazing I don't understand what it is but they are just it when you need to remove a lip color that's one of those bright matte colors or super dark colors that don't come off with a regular makeup wipe and the next day you're still wearing half of the lip color this gets it off and I've been going through them like water I had to get another set now that it, we were um, you know they were having the sale and then I picked up this last but not least 
I picked up the NARS Algorithm Palette for the holidays. I did not get the blush this year. I skipped it because I've gotten the blush palettes for the past two years. If you haven't gotten it in the previous years, I highly suggest you get it this year because the packaging is to die. I picked this up. It's their Laguna Bronzer with a mini Eda brush. So when I saw that it came with the mini brush, I just had to have it. So it's so cute and I love the packaging so I can't wait to carry this around. This will be like my compact, my oversized obnoxious compact. So that is my haul. That is what I picked up this year. If you picked up anything from the sale, let me know in a comment below. I'll leave links to everything that I mentioned. Let me know what your wish list is for the holidays if you didn't pick anything up from the sale. And even if you didn't pick anything up, I still want some more things that I'm like... I wish I got it. I picked up their this palette by Stila, the Mind palette for the eyes. Was it the mind or the soul? But it was broken, so I have to go exchange it. So anyway, that's what's on my mind right now. So definitely let me know what's on yours. And I'll leave links to all of my social media so you can follow me on there. I'm Vinyl Blush on Twitter and Instagram and on my blog, which is new, which is the name of it. So um, that's why I changed my Twitter and my Instagram name. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and I will see you next time. Bye.